Assalamu alaikum everyone. Today I have the program of pick and place XYZ. This is the last program of factory IO. After this, I am going to move on to the lectures of HMI. So let's carry on. This is the factory scene of pick and place XYZ, and here I have the program TIA program for the pick, pick and place XYZ. So let me explain this scene first. Uh, this is this conveyor. This conveyor here is known as the part conveyor. This conveyor is bringing boxes, boxes from the uh, from the end to the front. This conveyor here, this conveyor is known as the uh, part uh, the box conveyor, which is bringing the pop pallets, pallets from 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 this place to this place. And this is the exit conveyor, the conveyor at the end. This conveyor, this conveyor is the exit conveyor. So I want to uh, zoom in the switch board. So let me explain the switches here. This uh, this is the start switch. The green switch is the start switch. This is the stop switch uh, to pause the system in any situation. And this is the reset switch to reset the reset the whole system. This knob is for setting setting the set. That means you can. I have designed this uh, design the system in four ways. So let's uh, for example. If you want to uh, move three box, three uh, take three boxes from this conveyor and put those three boxes onto this pallet. So you can do that. I have designed it for three boxes at a time, four boxes at a time, five and six. So you can uh, you can uh, collect three box at a time, four box at a time, five, six. So with these knobs, with the, with this knob, this knob, you can set uh, set dot uh, set that limit. Um, uh, three, four, or five, or six. So you can see that onto this conveyor. So if you are setting three, that uh, then this uh, blue light will glow. If you setting four, then this gr green light will uh, glow. If you set five, then this yellow light, and if you set, uh, if you set six with this knob, then th this red light will glow. Although you don't need these indicators because you can see the uh, number of boxes that you have set. Or collection so if you set three you can see uh, see here you can if you set four five or six you can see it here so this display is going to show how many boxes that you have collected from the part conveyor this is the part conveyor and here I have the uh, auto and manual mode though I have only designed this for the auto mode so let's run the system first now oh, this this system is already running so reset the system put the system into auto mode and uh, let's set it for 3 and uh, let's press this start button so this pick and place xyz robot is going to collect 3 boxes and put those boxes onto these pallets so first box second box and the third box then after that this pallet will move forward that's it okay done so you can see that uh, that that pick and place robot that have collected has collected four boxes so i'm counting the boxes when this robot is leaving the box onto this onto this pallet so when it is leaving then i am counting here if you can see the when it is leaving leaving the box onto this pallet then i'm then i'm counting and the counting is show, is showing is, show, is showing onto this display so i have set 3 let let's let, let make it 4 let's make it 4 reset the system put the system into auto mode uh, set it to 4 and press this start button again if you press the start button the display will reset so press, press the start button the green LED is glowing now the speak and plus XYZ robot is going uh, will going to collect 4 boxes and put those boxes onto the onto this pallet Again, it will collect the last box, which one is the fourth one. Okay, after the fourth box, the pallet is moving forward. So let's make it five now. 
Now you can make it five. Let's make it five here. Okay, now five. So this pick and place robot is going to collect the five boxes. Third box. This is the fourth box. And now the last box. So this is the fifth box. And now the pallet will move forward. So let's make it six. The last setup. When I'm making this six, the red LED is glowing. So first box. The second one. This one is the third one. Fourth box. So you can see here that when when the robot is leaving the box, then you can then you are counting the box. So the fifth box and now the last box. This is the sixth box and now the plate is moving forward. So that is how I have designed this program. So let's stop the system. You can pause the system. So that is all about the program. Uh, in the next video, I will be starting. I will be starting the uh, HMI tutorials. So that is uh, all for today. I will see you guys in the next video with the HMI tutorials. So till then, take care and goodbye.